Hello, I'm Dr. Terry Cup, pharmacist for close to 10 years now, and I am back uh, today with another video chat and, um, on this topic. As you can see in the title, I am talking about uh, dermatology, or more specifically, OTC uh, washes, soaps, cleansers, um, also uh, pads uh, that can be purchased over the counter, some mostly over the counter, and then some that are, are uh, prescription only. So I do want to go over some uh, key points. And to start off, please subscribe, like, and share uh, to this channel. First uh, ingredient, ingredient mostly that you'll see over the counter is going to be the salicylic acid. Salicylic acid, 5% is what you're going to see in most products. It is a, a primary formula. It is first choice. Um, the dermatologist will usually for mild cases um, it is uh, the pricing is not very expensive it does come in foam solutions pumps um, also maybe soaps as well in your uh, hygiene or dermatology department pharmacy department usually these products are uh, apply to the skin once up to three times a day, uh, no more than three to four times a day because we don't want to uh, cause dryness, um, uh, redness, or dry skin even. And it's indicated for anti-inflammatory purposes to clean out the, the, very, um, the very surface of the skin, not deep down into the follicle, not deep down into where the, uh, the, the follicles are and the uh, pores are, but just to give a, a, a mainly a surface cleaning. And again, that's going to be once to three times a day. You're going to apply for about five seconds to, uh, I'm sorry, 15 seconds to about five minutes. Let sit, and then you're going to rinse thoroughly with clean water. And then pat dry with a clean towel. And um, the duration of therapy is usually uh, anywhere from two months all the way up to three months, usually. And no more than that. If more than that, then definitely uh, seek um, stronger medicated products. Another product uh, ingredient that you'll see is the benzoyl peroxide. Benzoyl peroxide is very popular as well, and it's one of my choices because I've used it personally, and I think it is uh, similar to the uh, salicylic acid. It works uh, topically only, and it is uh, good for skin that is for mild condition, um, uh, anti-inflammatory conditions only, not for strong or severe cases. Can it be applied once a day, up to three to four times well? The pricing is pretty pretty, pretty reasonable. Uh, there might be discounts as well that you can, um, coupons as well that might be out there. And then also there are sulfur products, chlorhexidine products. Those products are a little bit uh, stronger, can be for maybe small to moderate cases, um, in soaps and um, some in liquid form. They are uh, antimicrobial in uh, certain cases, antiseptic, where they, they, they target bacteria on the skin to help replenish the skin with good bacteria and uh, increase the, um, the beautification of the skin, not just for aesthetics, but for cleaning purposes as well. You want to get deep down into the pores, get deep down into where the skin uh, surface, the epidermis skin is to clean out periodically. I will use these uh, products maybe once or twice a day uh, for uh, maybe two months or so, uh, two months to three months. Also, there's antibiotic clindamycin that is uh, an active ingredient that is uh, incorporated into alcohol uh, detergent. Uh, and that it usually comes in a pad form. Uh, you apply to the skin with the pad and you use it as directed. Most of these are prescription. And then there's some that may be over the counter as well. Uh, clindamycin is an antibiotic uh, for the dermis and it can be, uh, again, purchased uh, through prescription or uh, over the counter, just depending on the severity of the case. Side effects of topical products uh, for cleaning can be irritation, dry skin, redness, uh, acne itself, um, also um, 
decrease in moisturization, dehydration. After applying these products, I would recommend that patients use moisturizers like a vitamin E product, uh, vitamin E products, CeraVe products. Cetaphil is a good brand as well. CeraVe is a good brand. Cetaphil is a good brand. Cetaphil Professional is also comes in a wash as well that helps to remove um, surface makes the skin a little bit smoother uh, for moderate cases also is available over the counter um, it can be purchased at a reasonable price i think maybe the most is maybe twenty dollars thirty dollars for a bottle of cetaphil a cleanser professional it says on the bottle cetaphil professional and it comes in a pump form and it's also good uh, to use uh, up to three times a day. Usually mornings uh, is a good time to uh, utilize uh, these washes. And then the, the moisturizer, the same brand as well. Moisturizers, again, such as vitamin E products, a serum. There is a good product, Petrolatum. I don't recommend Petrolatum so much, uh, but it, it is a, a product that you can find in a lot of the popular brands, uh, but not just plain Petrolatum. Choose one that has an, uh, vitamin E, vitamin A, also uh, products that have uh, sunscreen um, in it as well is also good. Um, products that have... Um, um, products that have not only vitamin E, vitamin A sunscreen, but have um, moisturizing um, specifically for the skin and for um, certain brands that I recommend. So do look for those in addition to the washes, the soaps and the, the uh, foams. And another product that I uh, have seen um, is the, the uh, product is oxy is it ox the the oxy product that's very popular that you see on commercials um comes to my mind it is very popular and it is used daily on a regular basis but consistently if with consistency these products can work but if you if if you're not consistent with these products then it won't work very well but i do recommend consistency throughout the duration of therapy just so you can see the proper outcome in a, an adequate time uh so do remember that among our uh, teenagers and our juvenile patients young adults even uh, mid-aged adults still experiencing acne, do remember that consistency with these soaps, with these wipes and foams is the key to receiving the best outcome because not only is the active ingredient going to work so far, you have to be consistent with these products as well, um, even if it's just once a day uh, or twice a day. Um, some can be taken up to four times a day, applied four times a day, but do at least once a day, okay? And if there are any topic um, content that you would like to see or like to know about, please let me know. I am Dr. Erica, pharmacist uh, for close to 10 years, and I am uh, available also on my website, www themillenniumpharmacy.com. I'm available on Twitter and TikTok as well. Um, please, uh, subscribe to this channel, like, and share as well. Okay. Now, if there's any comments or suggestions that you may have, please let me know in the comments section, and I'm signing off. This is Dr. Erica.